Hello everyone, welcome to my channel HD Orion. We are studying accountancy for class 12 from T.S. Garewal's textbook 2023 edition Accounting for Partnership Forms. Chapter 4 Admission of a Partner. And in this video, we will discuss questions related to when only part of premium for goodwill is brought by new partner in cash. So let us see some questions from the textbook. Question number 30. A and B are partners sharing profits in the ratio of 2 is to 1. They admit C for one fourth share in the profits. C brings rupees 30,000 for his capital and rupees 8,000 out of his share of rupees 10,000 for goodwill. Now here C's portion of goodwill is rupees 10,000 but C could manage only to bring rupees 8,000 to the firm. 2,000 is not brought in cash by C. Before admission, goodwill existed in the books at rupees 18,000. Past journal entries to give effect to the above transactions. So let us see the accounting treatment of this. So solution 30. In this first, we will write off the old existing goodwill in the firm and it will be written off in A's, A and B's capital accounts in their old ratio. So A's capital account debited, B's capital account also debited because this is a, uh, a goodwill or an asset existing in the books at rupees 18,000. So when it is written off in the ratio 2 is to 1, 12,000 and rupees 6,000 being old goodwill written off in old ratio that is 2 is to 1. Now for the admission of partner C, C is bringing his portion of capital. So to C's capital account, cash account debited to C's capital account and to premium for goodwill. Now goodwill for C is rupees 10,000 but he could manage only to bring rupees 8,000 and his full capital rupees 30,000. So 38,000 rupees is received by the firm from new partner C. Being C's capital plus goodwill received. Now we will give the benefit of premium for goodwill to the old partners because they have sacrificed a portion of their profit in favor of C. Now we will transfer rupees 8000 premium for goodwill to sacrificing partners. So premium for goodwill. Account debited rupees 8000. But C's portion of goodwill was rupees 10,000. So the benefit of rupees 2000 is also to be given to the sacrificers. For this new partner C's current account will be debited. Fine. It was 10,000 rupees and 8,000 is brought in cash. So 2,000 rupees with C's current account will be debited. And now it will be transferred to old partner's capital accounts. So to A's capital account and to B's capital account. In their sacrificing ratio. Because new ratio is not suggested in the question. Neither is sacrificing ratio of uh, old partners is suggested. It means your old ratio will be your sacrificing ratio means to accommodate the new partner c a and b will sacrifice in their old profit sharing ratio so that is their sacrificing ratio which is 2 is to 1 so when you break 10000 in 2 is to 1 it is 6667 and 3333 being goodwill to old partners in sacrificing ratio which is 2 is to 1. Now question number 31. A and B are partners sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 3 is to 2. They admit C as a partner in the firm for one fourth share in the profits which he takes one sixth from A and one twelfth from B. Now uh, because the sacrificing ratio is already given in the question. Therefore, the new ratio will be different than the old ratio for partners A and B. Here, one sixth and one twelfth are the sacrificing ratio of A and B. 
if you calculate one sixth is to one twelfth, then you will get two is to one. So here sacrificing ratio is two is to one. C brings sixty percentage of its share of firm's goodwill. Fine, whatever was the she, whatever was C's goodwill, he could only bring sixty percentage of it in cash, and remaining forty percentage he could not bring. Goodwill of the firm was valued at rupees one lakh. Past necessary journal entries to record this arrangement. So let us see the solution. Now solution in this uh, C the new partner C is bringing sixty percentage of his portion of goodwill. For that cash account or bank account will be debited. Fine cash account debited to premium for goodwill. Premium for goodwill. Now. Firm's goodwill is one lakh rupees, and new partner C's portion is one fourth of it. So C was supposed to bring one fourth of one lakh, that is twenty five thousand rupees, but he is bringing only sixty percentage of it. So when you solve this, you get fifteen thousand rupees as brought in cash, being sixty percentage of. C's goodwill brought in cash. Now, benefit of this premium will be given to the sacrificing partners. Fine, because they have accommodated the new partner and they have sacrificed their portion of profit in favor of the new partner, and therefore, this premium will be given to the sacrificers. so premium for goodwill premium for goodwill account debited rupees 15000 but c was supposed to bring how much 25000 rupees so remaining 10000 rupees he is unable to bring for this c's current account will be debited c's current account out of 25000 He has brought rupees fifteen thousand. Out of twenty five thousand, he has brought rupees fifteen thousand. So remaining ten thousand rupees, which is not brought in cash by new partner C, for this C's current account will be debited. Now entire twenty five thousand will be transferred to partner A and B for their sacrifices in their capital account. and uh, what is the sacrificing ratio sacrificing ratio is 1 by 6 is to 1 by 12 so when you make the denominators common you multiply and divide it by 2 you see 2 and 2 now it becomes 2 by 12 is to 1 by 12 so sacrificing ratio is 2 is to 1 i hope you understand this part we have discussed the same in the previous uh, questions in the previous videos and i hope that you have not you have not missed any of the previous videos and i will suggest that do not miss any part of the video do not skip the video watch the entire video it is very very informative for you and i know you will like this very much so when rupees 25000 is broken in the ratio 2 is to 1 how much will a get 16667 And eight thousand three hundred and thirty-three. So this way, the treatment of goodwill is to be done. Now you can make these two make uh, two separate entries here. One for premium for goodwill transferred to A and B in sacrificing ratio, and one for current account for not bringing the portion of goodwill to partners uh, capital account in their sacrificing ratio. Now that two separate journal entries are mentioned in the book. you can refer to it but a collective entry such type of collective collective entry can also be made i hope you have understood this so i hope that you have watched the full video without skipping it and have understood the concept very well despite this if you are having any doubt then please put it in the comment section thank you so much for liking subscribing and sharing this channel thank you so much for watching this video